Until you learn etiquette, the celebrations will wait. But we were just dancing. Mother made it a family tradition. Hmm. And sadly, your mummy isn't here anymore, is she? And I am responsible for your upbringing. So dancing is forbidden, strictly forbidden, and please don't sing. It's out too. But it's our birthday. A princess does not talk back. No dancing until you know how to act like royalty. Where's Papa? He's never forgotten our birthday. We still have a present for you. When we turned five, Mother gave each of us a copy of her favorite story. She had one maid for each daughter. The Dancing Princess. So the princess danced on each of the special stones. Then, on the twelfth one, she twirled three times, and a secret door opened. Where did it go? She walked through a glowing light into a magic land, with trees of silver and gold, flowers made of jewels. Across the lake was a golden pavilion. The princess danced and danced to her heart's content. She wanted to stay forever, but that was not to be. The magic land vanished after the third night. The princess was heartbroken until she realized she had brought some magic back with her, and it was hers to keep forever. What kind of magic? How did she do it? Hmm, it doesn't say. <laughs> Kathleen, let me see your book. Girls, quick, see if you can match the flower on your book to a flower on a stone. I found a match. Me too. Me too. Here's mine. 